The woman with the microphone is Fedwa Suleiman. As a well-known actress in Syria, her voice carries a lot of weight, and now her famous face belongs to the uprising. The Aleppo native has been in Homs for weeks now, appealing to all Syrians to join the fight against the government of President Bashar al-Assad. I call on you today to take to streets and squares, declaring civil disobedience and hunger strikes, until all the army and security forces are pulled out of the neighborhoods and streets, and all political detainees standing behind the bars of oppression are released. She says she knows her fate is either death or prison, but she won't be silenced. Since yesterday, neighborhoods in Homs are being stormed in search of me. People are beaten, tortured for information, and if I'm located or the repressive apparatus of the regime arrests me, I'll have to make a televised confession and say that I am part of a terrorist conspiracy against the Syrian regime. A star of television and radio, she is also from the elite Alawite sect, a branch of Shia Islam and the same as President al-Assad. She has turned her back on her family and they on her. After appearing on Al Jazeera for the first time in November, her family disowned her and said her actions were probably motivated by money. We actors and actresses cannot stay at home while we watch people being treated like this. Children are killed, women violated, men murdered. No matter what will happen to me, at the end of the day it is Syria, my homeland. We must all sacrifice as freedom has a price that has to be paid by all of us. Suleiman's videos are all over the internet. She appears determined to tell the story of the people of Homs. <laughs> Citizen journalist, activist, traitor. Whatever she's called, Fadwa Suleiman is embracing the role of a lifetime. Nisreen al-Shamayli al-Jazeera, Amman.